Good afternoon. It's uh, 2 p.m. on the 16th, Saturday, May 2022. This is uh, David Lynn, and uh, it's been about three weeks since I've done a video. I haven't really been motivated to do. Uh, I do about one a month. I'm, my channel is not one of those where I'm constantly posting stuff. So uh, what you see is a lot of times it's just spur of the moment I decide to make a video about something. Um, I'm off for a couple of days, so I decided to make a video today. And today I'm going to talk to you about a first aid kit uh, that I like. And I'll go through it and uh, let you know what I paid for it. So let's get started. This is the uh, what they call the Good Neighbor Pharmacy. Rogers Pharmacy, it's a first aid kit. Uh, it's an easy one, it's in a soft case. Uh, I paid $15.30 for it with tax. This is what comes in it. If you wanna examine the contents, we'll go through them. So it comes in the soft zippered case. It has a handle. And it's um, it's got space in it so you can put some additional things in it if you want to. Uh, I have several of these. I have my wife and my daughter each have one in their curry bag. This is going in my curry bag. Uh, so let's go through the contents. To begin with, it's modular. It's got uh, a module for what they call small cuts and burns. It's got a module for medium cuts and scratches. It's got a module for severe bleeding and burns. It's got a, a module for uh, CPR. It's got a module for protection. And it's got a module for plastic tweezers, assorted safety pins, scissors, emergency first aid guide and wooden finger splints. And then on the back side you can see what's in it. So it's got instruments, scissors, tweezers, such. It's got protection, cold compress, gauze, for CPR it's got one of those little things you put over a person's uh, mouth with a little uh, connector so you can breathe through it so you're not actually making contact with their lips. Uh, items for severe uh, bleeding and burns, tape, you need to treat it, and um, more gauze and band-aids. swabs, an assortment of size band-aids, and then you've got a packet of various um, aspirin, emodium, alcohol wipes, things that you would use to clean and to, for, for basic, you know, things that you need, you can add to it, uh, different items. So this was a uh, brief overview, and uh, hopefully it's helpful. Uh, first aid kits are something for everybody's carry bag. You need to have one in your car, in your bathroom, in your kitchen. Uh, depending on how much you put in extra, you can put into it. Uh, I like that soft case one. Uh, it allows you to put additional things in it, like you can put some gloves. Uh, you can put a little flashlight in it. Um, I get extra packets of different types of medications for upset stomach, for uh, nausea, uh, Benadryl. Uh, you can you can get little packets like on Amazon or Walmart of extras that you can buy for eight or ten dollars. Uh, the first aid kit itself costs just over fifteen dollars plus tax, uh, twenty dollars, and you know you got change in your pocket. Uh, Everybody should carry one. 
uh, hopefully my review gave you enough information to know whether you'd like to buy one like it. Um, please like, share, subscribe, leave a comment to support the channel. Uh, my email address and my PO box are going to be in the description. If you'd like to uh, contact me, I'd be happy to uh, uh, speak with you. Um, please always be prepared and everybody have a blessed day and uh, drink coffee. This is my MRE Nation um, coffee cup and uh, I have one for an MRE.com too. There's this white. It's got the logo on it. This one's got the uh, uh, MRE Nation logo. Um, happy Easter. This is your Purple Principal and uh, wishing you a happy Easter.